Welcome to AJ Baytech, your guide for Baytech and BN. In the today's lecture, we will discuss about a FET, field effect transistor. Why FET is known as a unipolar? Why FET is known as voltage control device? Why FET is known as voltage variable resistor? Why FET is known as a constant current source device? This all we will discuss today. Okay, students. Okay, before. Uh, going that classification of transistors, these transistors are classified different kinds that is BJT and FET. FET stands for field effect transistor, field effect transistor. BJT stands for bipolar junction transistor. Okay, these are classified two kinds, NPN transistor, PNP transistor. FET classified two types, they are JFET and MOSFET. Okay, JFET classified two types, that is N-channel, N-channel JFET, P-channel JFET. P channel J FET. Next, this MOSFET has been classified two types that is enhancement mode, depletion mode. Enhancement. Again, this classified E N MOSFET, E P MOSFET. Again, depletion mode classified two types. DN MOS, DP MOS. This is the classification of transistors. Okay. Now, students, you can remember this JFET is a depletion type. Depletion mode means a channel is a channel is established a channel is established between source to drain a channel is established between source to drain then it is known as depletion type mode ok the JFET is a depletion type mode if it create a channel by applying a gate voltage, then we will call it is an enhancement mode type. Ok students, now we will discuss a FET, FET stands for field effect transistor, field effect transistor. Ok, now this is a FET, why FET is known as a uh, field effect transistor means the applied the applied gate voltage the applied gate voltage decides decides the output current output current that is id the applied gate voltage decides the output current id Okay, FET has, FET has three terminals which are active. Generally, we will call it is a four terminals, four terminals generally. But only three are been used, they are gate, drain, source. Another one is a body or substrate, body or substrate, not in use, not in use, ok. The active terminals, the active terminals of the FETs are three, that is gate, drain, source, these are the active, that is why it is uh, 
uh, has a, it has three terminals, we will call gate drain suits, but it has a four terminals basically that is gate drain suits and body. Is it clear? Now if you see a basic construction of a FET, now it is a device, a device. Now this is a N channel based. Suppose you are taking channel is a N channel based. This portion we will call as a source and this portion we will call as a drain. And the highly doped or a lightly doped because a lightly or a heavily doped P plus you can see here. This is P plus. Heavily doped, heavily doped P plus material is, material is placed, which is known as gate, which is known as gate. This terminal we'll call as a gate. Okay. A channel is, channel is moderate doped or just a moderate doped device. Gate terminal is gate terminal is heavily doped heavily doped material okay source and drain source and drain or always always same charges same material source if because the it is made in a channel source is a n type material uh, Source is an N type material, drain is also an N type material. Okay. Okay, it is a source, it is a drain, it is a gate. Source, drain, gate, channel. Both source and drain are N type material only. Gate is an opposite material. Next, if you say a basic comparisons of BJT and FET, BJT, FET. PJT stands for bipolar junction transistor. FET stands for field effect transistor. Next, current conduction. Current conduction in BJT is due to both majority majority and minority carriers current conduction in bjt is due to both majority and minority carriers okay current conduction current conduction in fact in fact, is due to only majority carriers. Due to only majority carriers. That is why it is known as a unipolar. That is why it is known as both. Na? It is known as bipolar. 
okay this bjet is known as current control device current controlled device fet is known as voltage control device voltage controlled device next bjet is a bjet if you see the bjet bjet has three terminals what are they base collector emitter these are the three terminals here gate drain source next bjet is due to minority carriers due to minority charge carriers bjt is temperature sensitive temperature sensitive temperature sensitive bjt is a temperate okay there is no majority charge carry it works only majority there is no minority carriers in the fet that is why it is a not not a temperature sensitive element not a temperature sensitive element it is not a temperature sensitive element next bjt in bjt if you see it has high gain bandwidth product gain into bandwidth product means uh, this will study from the frequency responses okay we will stress on that point okay it has low low gain and bandwidth product gain and bandwidth product next bjt has high gain fat fat has low gain compared to bjt compared to bjt next fats are used in fats are used directly in fabrication directly in fabrication fabrication process it is a complex bjt is a complex fabrication process okay these are some there are some comparisons of bjt and fet fet devices okay students now we will see the construction of construction of jfet construction of jfet now suppose you can take n channel jfet n channel means the symbols you can see if arrow mark is this side this is a gate terminal it is a drain terminal it is a source terminal then it is an n channel if you take a p channel arrow mark this side
gate drain source it is a pay channel it is a n channel and it is a pay channel symbolic representation symbolic representation okay now if you see in the construction 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 of n channel j effect j effect i can say there is an n channel this is treated as source this is treated as drain okay p plus okay is a construction a heavily doped a heavily doped pay type material a heavily doped pay type material which act as which act as gate gate terminal act as a gate terminal gate from back side it is okay it's a gate terminal okay students now a heavily doped p type material which act as a gate terminal a heavily doped n type material which can act as a gate type material a lightly doped a lightly doped uh, n type material n type material which act as a channel which act as a channel okay from here you can see clearly okay now this is a this is a channel the green color it is a channel and uh, both source and drain are n type material source and drain are n type material okay now in this uh, by the definition you can write a a a n type material source and drain are connected to are connected to the channel channel on the either end on the either end okay at both the ends of the channel you are connecting with a uh, drain and source okay next a n type material source and drain are connected to the channel on the either end both source and source and drain are n type material n type material 
okay next now you can see here the voltage between here to here voltage between here to here we will call as a positive here we will call as a negative this we will call as a vgs means applying a gate voltage between source to gate and applying a voltage between vds this operation okay next an input voltage input voltage is applied between between source to gate terminal source to gate terminal known as vgs output voltage is applied between drain to source drain to source that is vds okay the symbol is like this n channel It is a gate. It is drain. It is source. This voltage we will call as VGS. This voltage we will call as VDS. Okay. gate voltage gate voltage that is vgs is always operated in reverse bias operated in reverse bias to find the output current output current that is ids drain to source current next the gate voltage the gate voltage that is vgs decides decides the amount of the amount of current flow current flow through the through the device okay the gate control okay the gate voltage vgs decides the amount of current flow through the device that is why fet is known as fet is known as voltage control device voltage control device input voltage decides the amount of current flow through the transistor or input applied applied electric field applied electric field decides decides the current flow current flow through the device through the device okay students in the today session we have discussed what are the different types of uh, uh, fets and what are the different types of transistor classifications are there and uh, how bjt is known as current control device and how fet is known as voltage control device okay in the next session we will discuss about uh, uh, current flow 
the IDS current flow through the fat. Easy B tech guide for B tech and B and. Thank you.